Hey, what is up guys? Marcy Fear back to do another video and this is going to be a world builder slash map uh, fix tutorial because I have uncovered and discovered something uh, pretty groundbreaking. And let me just first of all demonstrate the problem on maps with high uh, terrain spawn locations like this map here. You can see there's a difference in the height between this, this area and where I spawn. There is a problem when you scroll to the bottom of the map. When you get right to the bottom, you can see on the minimap that it doesn't actually go right to the bottom. And it's not scrolling down there. No matter how hard I try, this map is not going any further than that. And the way that you fix this um, without the workaround I'm about to show you in game is by scrolling around and then uh, doing that with your middle mouse button. And that's how you uh, can see the lower portions of the map. But uh, I think that's not necessary because I found a way to do that in World Builder and to fix this bug. So let me just go to World Builder right now so I can show you what I'm talking about. And my mic is working, I believe. Hopefully it is. Yep, I, I have, have got this set up a little bit weird. Nonetheless, though, we're in World Builder now. And the fix involves putting a waypoint on the lowest or a lower part of the map, like here and then making a script that essentially moves the camera at the start of the game to this waypoint. And then it waits several frames. In this case, uh, it's three frames. And then it uh, goes to this waypoint. And then it makes another counter with three th frames. And when that expires, it takes the camera back to the spawn location of the player. I've duplicated this script for both of the players because the camera has to move to uh, the player one start for player one and the player two camera has to move back to the players two uh, waypoint, which is here and here respectively. So that is the fix it involves a script and by the way because this happens at right at the start of the game you don't actually see it happen in game it's it's so quick that you don't see it occur so let me just go ahead and save this and then we're gonna go back into Kane's Wrath hopefully this works yet yeah, we're back in the game I'm going to go onto that custom map now and show you the difference with the uh, bottom of this map so Tournament Apocalypse is right here somewhere. Here it is. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and go on this one. And because it happens so fast, you're not even going to see it when the map loads, even though it's moving the camera. You literally didn't see it happen because it happened during that time it was fading in. So if I go to the bottom of the map now, you can see that I can see the bottom of the map and it's not bugging nearly as much as it was there's a significant difference in the amount of space and things that I can see down here. So the player no longer needs to adjust his game as much on maps with differences in terrain like this. It's only really a big problem on maps where the starting location of the player is much higher up. So yeah guys, that's going to be the quick and short video I wanted to make demonstrating this fix and I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, I know map making is a bit niche, but uh, yeah, I wanted to sh show and share this to you all because I believe it's important. So thank you all very much for watching this guys. And this is me, Master Leaf. Peace out.